This is awesome. view from the Olmstead Island Overlook the first stop from the visitor center now we're on to the headed towards the Billy Goat Trail trails in the whole Washington DC area. It's also considered a rock scramble and a fairly dangerous trail where people oftentimes have to be rescued. So it should be right up our alley. Let's go. closest thing to a western type landscape I've ever come across with the rocks and these pine trees and the rugged canyon. It's absolutely breathtaking. guys so as I said this Billy Goat Trail is considered to be a rock scramble and uh, 
we've been scrambling pretty good so far. It's actually divided into three sections, A, B, and C. Each one individually is a loop that starts on the canal path. Um, right now, section B is closed and we're on section A, which is considered the most difficult one. But um, this trail was like I, made for me. I was born for it. I'm just loving it so much. I gotta tell you, I woke up at 3 o'clock this morning, I drove for nearly 3 hours, 160 miles, and uh, I wasn't sure what to expect here. And I, if you follow the channel, you know I use a lot of adjectives, beautiful, amazing, <laughs> but this, this really is. This is a trail I would hike, I would come to this trail again and again and again. If you like rock scrambles, this is it. If the only downfall to this trail is that it's a secret that you can't keep. It's just amazing. It's popular. The crowds are picking up. But, uh, oh man, this is awesome. Just as the Billy Goat Trail takes you to one of its tamest, calmest places so far, right at the river's edge here, we begin a steep climb straight up this cliffside. And this is known as the most te technical aspect of the trail. So it should be fun. just standing on the edge of a cliff here and it's a sheer drop straight off the edge down there it almost looks like you could jump right in but this may be my favorite spot uh, you just have this view down the river I feel like I've seen this view before I think this photo has been taken before it must be a popular spot to take photos and I, you can see why absolutely lovely can't say enough good things about this trail. I'm so impressed.
So we did the billy goat section A. Now we're returning to the uh, canal path trail. Um, there's a lot of people out now. And uh, this terrain is so cool. What we're on is a place called Bear Island. It's got these rocks and there's wildflowers everywhere. And it's just beautiful. All right, my friends, we finally made it back to the car. What a hike, what a beautiful day. So much to see here. It's, it was unbelievable. The water, the, the river, the cliffs, the rocks, wildflowers, birds, turtles, frogs, um, the trails, even the canal. Everything was so beautiful. This is now my favorite hike of all the ones I've been on in the last year and a half. And um, it's a little past noon now. I've been on the trail for five hours. And when I got here, there were about four other cars in the parking lot and there's, there's hundreds here now. So this place is very popular. It gets crowded. It's understandable because it is a gem. I was blown away. I really didn't expect to be this impressed with the beauty of this place and just just outside of the city of Washington, D.C. So this was a real treat. This was a really special hike. I hope the video does it justice. But um, it's time to hit the road. And I uh, just want to say thanks for coming along on another adventure. And uh, until next time, see you on the trail. Gator out.